Okay. What do we have right now on Loot Crate? Well, we got Loot Crate. Ah. <laughs> Unopened. Good to know. And now it's open. So, I think it's kind of like a scavenger, I think. Scavenger. Well, first things first, I am keeping this. What, what is it, Aisha? Actually, no, you can have it. It's an alien prepared box. So you get let's see twelve different characters. So I think that's kinda interesting. So it's like a pop vinyl type of shit. It's not a figure? pop vinyl. It's more like um like the little Diablo figurines that came Oh the yes, back. yes, 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 yes. Okay, yes. so it's kinda like that. So it's like a mystery box. Because even with the plot vinyl, they'll actually show you exactly what you get. Mm. And then next, you have a reversible Daredevil <laughs> beanie. You know anybody who's a big Daredevil fan? Which has Punisher. Oh, wow. So, I am definitely keeping this. Hmm. And then you have your Alien vs. Predator pin. So... I think kind of cool. I think this month's uh, theme is uh, versus. I think so too. <gasps> okay, I am definitely keeping. Uh, no, 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 no. Yeah, I got. I want to know what is it. <laughs> You're asking this. Uh, uh, what's it called? What then? Yeah, para tu cabello. Yes. Noche? Yes, I do. Okay. Buenas tardes. Okay. ¿Cómo estás? Bien, gracias. Aquí va. ¿Cómo se cierra la puerta? Sí, ¿estás seguro de no quieres que? ¿Me ven en toalla? Okay, I'm... okay, so we actually had a Batman versus Superman paper wallet, and this <sighs> this is actually the same type of people that had the Simpsons wallet. Yes, yes. So, oh, we got money. Wow, uh, you think they'll pay the credit card with that? Well, it says use code blank for five dollars off, orders of thirty bucks or more. And then you have the Mighty Wallet business card, of course. Hmm. So, if you want five bucks, here you go. Oh, that's very sweet of you, Asha. Thank you. And then it says, take the challenge and post it. Mighty Wallet could feature you dare to tear. Okay, what side are you on? Show your side. Batman, or oh, Bat versus Alien. So, hmm. I'm not sure what this challenge is. It doesn't say what it is. Hmm. But kind of the sad part but the wallet I think that's about it so okay the wallet. next we have I believe this is a Star Trek shirt so it created by Jean I can't pronounce the last name it says mirror mirror I'm guessing it was a featured film of some sort I could be wrong well, I'm not really much of a Trekkie, but I do know some people who are into it. You remember uh, Tanya, uh, our ex-manager from uh, Desert Sands? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. She's a big Trekkie, so okay. I think I could definitely ask her what the hell was that about. Right, and then you have Word Gush, a party game about everything you love. So, I guess it's actually supposed to be an app on your phone. It says free to download and play on your smartphone. Only one phone needed to play. No internet, no problem. Multiple categories to choose from, including video games, comics, movies, and more. Multiple modes of play include team versus charades and Hamatoon. Loot Crate subscribers can unlock a free exclusive bonus categories in April. So, I guess it's kind of like where you put the card here. Oh, then, just like in Glorious Bastards. Yeah. So it's like that. I might keep that. And then we have a Harley Quinn number one exclusive from the Crate comic book. Oh, wow. Take a look at that. Nice. So, yeah. I'm taking that one. Okay. Huh. It's interesting. Mm hmm There you go. And then last, obviously, we have our wonderful book that, that describes things that are obviously featured in our box. Uh, how to 
instructions on how to how to defeat an opponent for geeks and gamers. So that's always a wicked thing. Mm. Let's see what else we got in here. What's in Harley's purse doing? So they got that. Um, more promotions. Ooh, you even get to find Spock the Spock. Oh, Waldo. so move over, Waldo. Right? You got Spock. Apparently. Live long and prosper, Aisha. Live long and prosper. My fight story. Okay. I'm not sure. Okay, everyone who has ever been online knows that geek fights, plastic lasers, lightsabers optional, are epic. But how epic? We asked around the loot trade office to bring you the best of our personal battles. So, I guess it's just like a little story. Mm. It's the totally fake superhero rivalries. We put them to the measure. So, you got Plastic Man, Elongated Man, Mr. Fantastic, Gorilla Grodd, Ultra Humanite, Kong Gorilla, Monsieur Mala, Detective Chimp, Billy Batson, Carol Danvers, Kamala Khan, Marvel, and Monica Rabu. Mm. And it's, it stretches. Atheist and Marvelous. There's your chart. In case you're wondering. Oh, look at that. Let's see. Get the evil doppelganger look. This is actually kind of interesting. And then... I think that's it. And yeah. that just pretty much tells you what you get in the crate. So what do you think was like the best stuff? In this area, and in this uh, box station, what do you think was the best thing? Um, I mean, I get a wallet with Henry Cavill. Henry Cavill. No, it's Cavill. Oh, really? It's Cav Cavill, not Cavill. Yeah, no, it's Cavill. So, it's like, uh, Stephen Amell. It's not, it's, it was it Amel or is it Amel? Well, it's Stephen Amell. Amel. Amel, yeah. Amel. And then, this is actually kind of interesting. I actually want to get this on my phone just so I can play with Gary. Hmm. Well, I think uh, that would help out a lot, and especially if we ever go to those conventions, we could always use that as to, you know, kill out time. Yeah, true. And then, obviously, the Daredevil, because season two just came out this yes. week, and I am already in episode six. Wow, I'm, I'm right now on, the, I just finished up episode two, so yeah. maybe tonight or tomorrow I'll catch up with another two or three episodes. I'm not that eager to finish up the entire season. I'm just eager to just keep watching it because it's getting pretty good. Oh, yeah. But the thing is that once you're done with that, you have to wait for an entire year until the next season comes out. Well, see, that's the beauty is that there's other things to do while you wait. And then whenever you finally, that year does come around, mm -hmm. you're like, hell yeah, give me that. You know, like... Right now, I'm just waiting patiently for Game of Thrones, and then, like right now, I'm watching Magic Mike, so... Why are you watching Magic Mike? It's a really fun, it's a really interesting movie, you know, who yeah, knows? you're a girl, sure. Uh, well, I've seen Showgirls as well, and it was well, okay. Showgirls is for guys. Well, I didn't like the movie anyway. Well, let me find out, you're into freaking Channing Tatum. Well, n no, not exactly, more like uh, Matthew McConaughey, oh like... God. Yeah, I know what's going on. I don't know if that's like I don't know how I feel about that. But that's that's it for the lit crate. That's good. So what would you rate this between a scale of uh one being piece of shit and five being superb? Um I'll probably give it like a three and a half. Okay. I mean I'm not really into I mean this isn't really my theme, mm -hmm. but I mean, it does come with stuff that I do like, like beanies, the mm -hmm. wallet, the game. So I think it's all right. I know that there's other people who would be like, oh my God, but, and the comic, of course. Right. But for me, I mean, if you're basing it on my taste, it was like a three and a half. Yeah, me, me too. I think this was more like a, more into pop culture, you know, comics and stuff stuff but uh i mean who knows maybe the i don't know if the anime crate and the uh gamer uh crate 
has uh, similar themes as uh, right now this month's uh, verses. Uh, I don't know. Yeah, do you know anyone else who does uh, who is a subscriber for uh, Loot Crate as well? Um, yeah, actually, two of my coworkers got Loot Crate for their son's birthday, mm. and. <laughs> One of them actually forgot to cancel her subscription. So it's still going. So it was still going on for a while. So her son isn't going to be getting any presents like for like about a year. Because <laughs> he basically got one like every month. Oh, yeah. So. Well, actually, you have options. You know, you could the more uh, boxes you order, uh, the more you save. But then again, that's the more expensive. But uh I think right now, if you go for Anime Crate or Loot Crate, I think it's a little bit more expensive, mm -hmm. but it does really hit to your your favorites. Your favorites. Yeah. Like for me, I'm more into a gamer, so I mean, who knows? Maybe eventually I would cancel the regular root, um, Loot Crate yeah. and go for the Gamer Crate. Right. See, I would go for anime, but I haven't watched anime in such a long time, so mm -hmm. I wouldn't... Like if I were to get a box, say, like, like two months from now, mm -hmm. and it's stuff that I don't know... Like, I'm going to be so confused. But I don't want, you know, the... What's it called? I can't think of the word now. The the one that's, like, commonly known. Like, I don't want... Mainstream. Like, yeah, I don't want, like, super mainstream. Like, Naruto and... Naruto and One Piece. Like, you know, there's some... There's some of the animes that are really, really good besides those. Mm. And... I think that's something that Loot Crate and Anime and Video Game Crate can all keep in mind is that whenever they're doing this, like, yes, it's it's nice to have one or two items that are are pop, like, are, are really popular right now, but still keep in mind that there's some of us who have been watching anime, who have been playing video games much longer, and the whole point is to get, you know, Everybody, please, not just like the newcomers and stuff. Right, right. Okay, I guess this wraps up on the uh, versus theme. And uh, yeah. right now, I am still thinking about getting gamer crates, so I'm not sure when, but it will be soon. So, any last words, Aisha, before we log off? Um, thank you for giving me a wallet of Henry Cavill. You're extremely ca uh, welcome. So, uh, just uh. Make sure you take care of it, and you put it underneath it's your bed. It's gonna be plastered with like red lipstick. So well, yeah, I mean that's I I think everyone has a thing for Henry Cavill and I uh, and Cavill Cavill. Oh my gosh. So uh, well, it sucks to be you, Ben Affleck again. Sorry. But you always got Jennifer Garner. Oh wait, you don't anymore. You jerk. All right, bye guys.